special edition of Meek Productions Presents History of Black the America, the Atlanta chapter division and all of that good stuff. <laughs> We're here at the, uh, doing behind the scenes a little bit with our uh, second, uh, first, uh, yeah, second annual nightlife photo shoot under uh, Meek Productions, our parent company, and we're doing a special feature with our pioneers, <laughs> Poison Ivy Entertainment, the founders of The Other Side After Hours. I have both Steve and Mo on the side of me. What's going on with you all? Oh, good to go. Y'all good to go? We fine. <laughs> Glad to have you all a part of this historic moment and stuff. And uh, for those, no problem. For those people that didn't get a chance to see last year's Nightlife, where we featured uh, the Dream Team at Privé, uh, please check out our parent website, meekproductions.com. That information should be located at the bottom of this screen. A lot of folks don't know about Poison Ivy Entertainment, so kind of tell us a little bit about how you all got started. You want to start? I guess that's, I mean, <laughs> well, I, 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 so it, I mean, we've been doing this for five years, mm -hmm. just to start that off, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? And uh, uh, how we met each other, just kind of like coincidental, you know, um, just some people came up with some ideas and put some ideas together, and um, we just linked up and we just basically went from there. So five years in the game, we just, you know, linking up and just coming up with some great ideas. Yeah, wow. Uh, uh, how did you actually get uh, hooked up with uh, the other team? Um, well, our other business partner, David, who couldn't be here tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, Mo and David type. Mm -hmm. And I've been knowing David for a few years. Mm -hmm. And um, she asked him if he knew anyone else. Mm -hmm. He thought of me. Wow, wow. I was like, okay. And then the team was born. The team was born. Tell us about that first night, man. <laughs> I mean, I mean, can y'all just go back to that first night and the fact that you all had it at the historic, legendary Marquette Lounge? So kind of tell us about that. All I can say is, a lot of people, they was like, you know, that's crazy. A lot of people, they, so some people even say it to me now, and they were like, man, I can't believe it. I was like, I doubted it at first. I wasn't even coming there because nobody else was coming. Uh -huh. And I was like, that's fine. And then it picked up. Now they still coming. They still there. They still so coming. Like the first night, though, it was just like, you know, what it we was doing. already a nap hour was going on. Yeah. Uh huh. Within hours, we were just doing $5 all night. Uh huh. It was a struggle. Uh huh. Uh, but, you know, and free too, got Yeah, we did free too. <laughs> <laughs> we had time to kind of take off. You know, gotcha. Uh -huh. uh, believed in us and mm -hmm. let us ride it out a little bit. Mm -hmm. and a few days fell into place. Five years later. Wow, wow. Now, you've all, I know you all started at the Marquette Lounge, but uh, you all are actually at a new location now. Um, well, actually, at two. We still, still at the Marquette. Marquette. still at the Marquette? Yes, yeah, so on Friday. We're still there. We're still at the Marquette. Uh -huh. But, um, you know, we do here on Saturdays too. Level five. Uh -huh. Oh, by the Marquette 868, Joseph E. Boone on Friday. There you go. And here, uh -huh. uh, the V, 2101 Tula Street. Yeah. And I call that from Bankhead to Buckhead. Buckhead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> from the hood to the bougie. Okay. <laughs> Keep you humble. Mouse. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Keep you humble in the ATL. I hear you, man. I hear you. Uh, tell us a little bit about what's in store for the fifth anniversary celebration. All of that information is located at the bottom of the screen, by the way, for those of you who are watching. Kind of get dove into that. Yeah. Well, <laughs> still kind of being put together to finish the test. Yeah. Uh, we're having Mariah Lynn from Love and Hip Hop in New York. Mm -hmm. host. Okay. So, you know, we're going to be in this lovely venue. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a night to remember off the park. You're tuned in to Meek Productions syndicated shows. Don't go anywhere. We do have more in store. I tell my students that I teach sometimes be in love with the process, not the result. There was a time when I, when I thought this movie was impossible. So everybody behind me on the stage said, no, that is not acceptable. We didn't do this. You guys chose us. Thank you for the choice. I appreciate it. Very clearly, very clearly, even in my dreams, this could not be true. But to hell with dreams. I'm done with it because this is true. Oh, my goodness.
I, I, I mean, can you all, did you all actually think that you all would make it five years? Uh, I, I, I don't, I, it's, it's still like, a, to me, it's like an amazement. I don't know how. It, Definitely. But like, five, you know what I'm saying, five years on something that you actually love to do, it's mm -hmm. kind of like. Not even a job. Yeah. Wow. Yes. It's, it's kind of crazy, though. Wow. I didn't think it would. I mean, hope it would, but you can go. You don't go in there with ex expectations, cause you know, mm -hmm. like the nightlife shelf is short sometimes. Yeah, it is. So five years is huge. It is. It is. <laughs> Especially doing something that you actually like doing, like mm -hmm. that's crazy. So you know, I'm, I'm, I'm five years in the game. I said when I said it on the mic last night, I said five years in the game. The crowd went like crazy. I guess they couldn't believe like. You know what I'm saying? This yeah, party's been going on that long. Yeah. But yeah, like, yeah, yeah, five years, like. You no, know, it hasn't always been easy. I mean, you know, we have a clientele. We're grateful to our patrons mm -hmm. for riding out with us. We had to move around a few times. Mm -hmm. They followed us. Mm -hmm. Each time we had to move, I mean, it was a lot. I mean, it's a blessing. And you know, another thing that amazes me about you all is that even every Labor Day weekend, which of course is the annual Atlanta Black Pride celebration, it's like y'all get people coming in from out of town that they actually know who you all are. <laughs> that's that promo, that's that promo. Okay. <laughs> they actually know who you all are and everything. So that, that's really, really wonderful. Do, uh, do you all have any plans automatically for um, I mean, like, I think for Labor like, Day weekend? Because of Labor Day, it's kind of like crunch time. Mm -hmm. So, and doing Labor Day too, everybody's so like not in a rush to put out uh -huh. what they got going on. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Everybody trying to keep everything such a secret. You know uh -huh. what I'm saying? So when it just comes, it's like crunch time. So we don't necessarily know what artists we're going to have, what, you know, scenarios we're going to have coming through, but, you know, we pull it together. Yeah, pull it together. They know they're going to have an amazing time. Gotcha, That's gotcha. Sure. On that note, we're going to go ahead and uh, keep this short because we just wanted to give you a snippet of what's in store for Easter weekend, the fifth anniversary celebration of Poison Ivy Entertainment. For more information, check out the information located at the bottom of the screen and be on the lookout for their special feature in our second annual photo shoot and club promotions, Nightlife version 2.1. They going to have a feature in our photo shoot, baby. It's going to be hot when you see it, okay? <laughs> Mo and Steve, thank y'all so much. Follow me too, man. <laughs> if I follow them all on Instagram, on all forms of social media, Facebook, uh, Twitter, they, don't, they everywhere. You can reach me at Kangroo underscore E-N-T, L-L-C on IG. Yeah. And Steven Kangroo on Facebook. And on you. Mo got it, bro. Yes, and Poison Ivy ENT, that's on IG. All of that is located at the bottom of the screen. And until our next episode, please remember to know your history and know your heritage. We'll see you soon. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>